This is an XSRA.TV Speedway Race Report. Round 3 at Harley Night 2 and the Gary Hicks Remembrance Night at Costa Mesa Speedway. The fans enjoyed the best weather so far this summer at Costa Mesa. Let's watch how Round 3 played out. Heat 19, Max Rummel with 6 points, Brock Nickel with 5 points, Eddie Castro with 4 points, and Dave Clark with 2 points. At the start, Nickel from the pole position took the lead. Rummel from the outside on nickel-like paint. But Brock Nickel, sporting new colors this night at Costa Mesa, stayed in front of the 2022 U.S. National Champion to take the win. Rummel in second. This tied them up at eight points each, going into the scratch semi. Castro in third with five points, squeaked into the semi as well. Dave Clark with just two points, back to the trail. Heat 20, Wilbur Hancock with four points, Brad Sauer with three points, Austin Novarado with five points, and Slater Lightcap with two points. Sauer had a great start and lead until Novarado passed him on the outside in turn four. Lightcap worked his way under Sauer in lap two and chased after Novarado, but he couldn't make up the distance. Novarado would hold on to the lead and get the win for eight points. Lightcap in second with four points, Sauer with four points, Hancock with four points. All four would advance to the scratch semis. Heat 21, Dylan Rummel with five points, Michael Wells one point, Joey Donaldson zero points, and Sean McConnell three points. Rummel from the pole position took a commanding lead. Wells behind him, McConnell on the outside. Rummel stayed in the lead. Wells staying in second would lose it to McConnell in the back straight. The Wiley veteran pinching it low into turn three took second in the lap four. Dylan Rummel's win put him at eight points. Sean McConnell second at five points. Wells third with just two points. Donaldson last with a goose egg on the night. Both Wells and Donaldson were retired. Dylan Rummel and Sean McConnell would meet again in the scratch semi. Heat 22, Justin Allman with one point. Bobby Schwartz with zero points. Billy Gennaro with six points. Jordan Vanderham with one point. Gennaro with the fast start took the lead and never gave it up, finishing his night with a perfect nine points overall. The ever-improving Justin Allman stayed in second for three points. Jordan Vanderham beat out the veteran Bobby Schwartz for two points. Schwartz with a goose egg on the night but still out there spinning laps. The three would not advance but Billy Gennaro was headed for the scratch semis. Be sure to subscribe to this channel so you see all of our new race report uploads. That's an XSRA.TV Speedway Race Report on YouTube.